I, I don't know. I, I I guess. I mean, we're we're going now. We're live now. Not live, but we're recording now. But uh, okay. okay. What what were we gonna talk about? That's right. I don't know. I don't know. Yep. Well, I got Blade with me here today. Um, El Drago Hi, one fifty. Yeah. See, there he is. Yeah. <laughs> just you know, interrupt me. What a nice yeah, guy. I, I have to. Oh yes, he does. <laughs> well, we, okay. So El Drago one fifteen sent me the like told me they had a replay. And then the replay system is really, really struggling. Um, I did put in a request that they add in a search function for players. That way it's a little bit easier to find people and actually go over matches. Instead, El Drago took out the time to find his replay in the trending tab. So because he did that, he told me exactly where the page where, near where it was. It's actually a couple pages farther back than what it was. And uh, due to Xbox just being Xbox and me not having a great experience uh, <laughs> yeah that, that that is what it is but starting off we got 22 standard runs i like to see that 21 premiums and then uh 20 high explosives that's a lot of he though yeah that's a lot of he but still i mean but he's playing my favorite tank man he's playing the t29 so it's a beast el drago asked me to go over his replay and then ask how he's um performing and if there's any pointers that i can give so let's go ahead and dive into this Blade's here too, and keep in mind, Blade? Yeah, we're gonna be yes. showing off some uh, statistics at the end of this match. There we go, 311 right away, first shell. Nice shot. So let's actually go ahead and uh, hit this up now. LTG, Soul Reaper. You know, L LTG is actually an amazing little light tank. Yeah, it is. It is. Let's actually go ahead and disconnect. Ooh, artillery. Sky Cancer. Yes. Oh, now that we disconnect, all the tanks pop up on the map. <laughs> so I would like to see like uh, six sense icons that have them um, popped up saying that they're spotted or not. I have to zoom in to see this. Stug 33B. Yeah. Wait, that's no Stug. It's ugly. It, it's dead. Okay, <laughs> alright, hold on, hold on, hold on. I need to go back. One thing I like about this, LG right away, already showing this off. I actually like this. So let's go ahead and fast forward a tad bit since, you know, you can only reverse by 30 seconds. Let's go ahead and slow this down. One thing I liked about what I just saw with this shell, if he did it the way I think he did. Okay, so scratch that. For a moment there, I thought he focused up the tracks. Instead, his shell actually went high and hit the tracks on the side of the tank. Yeah, I thought he shot the tracks directly, but instead of the tracks directly, he hit the side of them. There we go against Cromwell. So far, and you know, they need to add a damage indicator too for each tank that you're hovering over inside the replay system. Yeah, it's it's hard to see who's shooting at who. There was a nice shot, 321. Yeah, but it, it could be better. He's keeping hall down. That's, he he I mean, is keeping hall down. That's what's nice. But one thing he can do, so one thing that El, El Drago can do, is that Tiger that pulled the corner, go for the tracks. Yep. A little bit damaging. too much time That's there on the uh, a little bit premature fire. Watching the rear. His situational awareness is nice. Yep. 311. 228, and then taking his focus off. Or he's uh, swinging around the other way. That was smart. Kind of. To wrap it all the way around. There you go. Not. Well, no, because he, he, his attention went forward rather than focused on that. You probably thought that maybe the team was going to be able to help him out. 323, it's not bad. I like the way he's playing. He's sticking with his team. He's working the um, yep. normal ridge line that you should be on. There we go. Yep. 349. No. So far from what I'm seeing, not bad. That artillery did some damage, didn't it? It's kind of hard to see. Yeah. A little bit. There he goes for the kill. Not much, though. Well, so Fast far, it game. Looks like he's doing a lot of stuff right. Oh, uh, for sure. Indeed. They hold down. He didn't take a lot of damage. He took some. A shot. Well, I mean, two. it's a T29. You know, your hull is kind of the um, point you don't want to expose yep. right here. It took him getting spotted to see that. So, the situational awareness is decent. And keep in mind, this guy has less than 4,000 matches played in the game as well. Right. You know. So, he's only going to get better. 
Yeah, he's only there's only room to grow. Only room to grow. I like that. He's going straight back to base. Except for the part is T29 slow. Oh, he's cruising at 33, 32. Yeah. And they get there in time. Um, it's done that the last thing. We'll go ahead and fast forward this. There we go. Final kill of the game, too. Go. Yeah. Yeah, nice. So, what, what, what did you... What was his total damage? Uh, it was going to be... Let me pull up the message here that he sent. 2,443 with 947 assisted and 900 blocked. You know, if, if I was going to sit and stop and, you know, say anything about it, I'd, I'd say that um, I really didn't see anything wrong. I'd say that's a good play. That's not a bad play. Uh, there's only room yeah, to grow after that. Yep. I mean, you can only shoot what you have in front of you to shoot at. So, I mean, every shot he made, it looked like he was pinning. So. Well, yes. A couple premature fires, though. Uh, but I wouldn't really say that's, like, a bad thing. Um, yeah, everybody has them every once in a while. Yeah, so for El Drago, the one thing I could say is you're in a T-29. You know, you have 10 degrees of gun depression. If I was you, I actually would have gone higher up the hill and tried to work that ridge line a little bit better. But then again, the amount of damage you took, you're top tier against, you know, tier 6s and tier 5s. So really, it's like you have a lot of advantage and then staying in the front line like he was with the high tier. And some people will probably say like, oh, 2,400 damage, that's not a lot of damage. In my eyes... If you do more than your hit points, he, and his hit points is only 1,250, you know, 2,400 right. damage, that's almost double the amount of hit points he has. I would say that's a good game instead of a tier 7. I agree. Now, for gameplay-wise, you know, one of the best things that you can probably always do is you see a heavy tank pulling a corner. I mean, that Tiger, for instance, take your time to aim for the tracks that'll actually help you get better results every single match. Because if you get a little bit of assist off a of track assist, that's more XP, that's more silver. I mean, there's a lot to it. I'm a master at tracking people. He is. He, the, the best. <laughs> <laughs> right. Even when I'm not trying. <laughs> <laughs> so, one thing I'm going to show off here is his stats. 49.41 win rate in the past 30 days. So, 49%, 40 49.5, we'll just round it off. Average tier, 7.5. Survival, 31.76. Uh, Kill-death ratio, 0 0.98. Honestly, KD doesn't have that much of a meaning, in my opinion, just because you got people who like to jump in, take the kills, still kills. I, we don't say still kills because that doesn't exist. If you can take a gun out of the game, you're going to take a gun out of the game. Um, yep, one thing that does matter, though, is damage ratio. And a 1.29 damage ratio, that's not bad. I would definitely say that's not bad. Um, yep. but if you're talking about like feeling bad or like not feeling good about having a 49% win rate or feeling good, uh, here's a person we can compare you to. Here's blade. Now keep in mind, blade yep. does play quite a bit with me and his original win rate. So his global is 53.35 and blade. If, if you want to share what your win rate was prior to playing with me. Oh, well, when I first met you, my win rate was 47%. It, it was pretty low, so yep. don't feel bad about 49. Because the thing is, if everyone had 55, <laughs> if everyone had 60, then who's the people suffering? You know, you, a, a game like this, you can't exactly have everyone with uh, a 60%, 55% win rate across the board. That's impossible. There's always going to be people that are going to be matched out at 50, matched out at 47, but it doesn't mean that you're a bad player. Now, yep. yeah, no, I'd say that there's not a whole lot I can say about your gameplay except for don't feel bad about playing aggressive and pushing in or taking a little bit of a risk. So, Cause sometimes taking a risk just to see what you can try and achieve. It's, sometimes it pays off. Yeah. I mean, I always tell blade, let's go do something stupid. And then we do something stupid and somehow it pays off. For instance, you jump over to me. I've got a 60.86 win rate right now with a 3,800 WN8. But it's to me, WN8 has no value because you can play a light tank, spot out for 10,000 assists, but do absolutely no damage. And guess what that game equals? Zero. 
zero W and eight. So W and eight to me doesn't have a whole lot of value. So El Drago, thank you for telling me about your replay and thank you for taking the time to go find out what page it was on in that trending tab. Um, yeah, thank you. Yep, and good match, man. GG. That's yeah, it's not a bad game. It's a short game, you know, and honestly, I'm looking forward to you sitting in more. <laughs> so as you progress down the road, let us know. We'll yeah, take a look at him. Because, I mean, like you said, he's only had, four, what, a little over 4,000 battles? 3,870 yeah. lifetime matches. Yeah. Yeah, see, so, I mean, yeah, he's he's got a, he's going to, yeah, he's going to improve a lot. His overall and, is 910 WN8. His last 30 days, which is his best so far. At twelve sixteen, and he'll get better. Yeah, no. As he start learning, as he learns weak spots and and angling and different things like that. See, and that was my problem. By the time I met you, I had ten thousand matches and never even thought about angles or hatches or, you know, where. To I want to say ten thousand. I because there's no way that we've only played five thousand matches together in the past well, three years that well, we've been back on I tanks. I had, but I, you know, what I mean, no, I mean, I at that time I didn't. I didn't completely, all right, it probably wasn't 10,000 matches, but <laughs> but I played quite a few, and most of it was just because I just didn't, I didn't take the time to learn the angles and weak spots, and I, I never looked at, you know, I never even looked, until I met you, I never even looked at an armor package to see what kind of armor was on a tank. Went out, I shot shit. I hoped that it worked. Yeah. It's because you're old. And now I have a much better grasp of the game. And my 1.8, since I started getting a better grasp of the game, has has gone up. I'll never be a super unicom. I know that. But I don't care. You know, I, I enjoy I, the game. And it's all about winning for me. Yeah, that, that's all that really matters. Other than that, you guys, hope you enjoyed this. Uh, just know if you guys have a replay that you want to send in, um, you got to put a view on it first and then give me the date the timestamp, send me a screenshot of the score. That way I can scroll down through the trending list. Now that it's actually loading, uh, beforehand for me, whenever I'd go in the replays and trending, it would just hit like the first three pages and then not load after that. And then after I put in my, uh, request, um, there was a little bit of a hot fix that popped up and now it's loading more pages now. So whatever they did, they did kind of fix it, but it's still tedious to find these replays. So, yep. El Drago, thank you for taking the time out to find it. That was awesome of you. Look forward to you sending in more. Yeah, that, that's going to be nice. Yep. Not really much to say. I mean, once you get a bit more of a haul down fight and you get a bit more of a um, chaotic situation going, that'd probably be a good one to send in. Yep. So, yeah. Yep, yep. I <laughs> This wasn't planned. This was like immediate too. So, <laughs> yep. no idea what to say. Yeah, I wasn't prepared. But. Neither was I. The thing is, is like but, it, it's so far down the list. I'm like, I gotta do this now, fast. <laughs> we'll we'll find wait. out if I uh, can't wait to see more replays and in and general. Hopefully, help some more people out. Yeah, just in general. I mean, hopefully the feedback's nice. I hope so. Yeah, don't don't feel bad about it. That's actually really good starting off. Just main, maintain, take time to aim out, depending on your equipment that you're using too, that also has a big effect and then the perks that you have. You know, Sixth Sense is one of the best perks to have. Track mechanic, born leader. Rapid loading is optional, but a lot of people say it's mandatory, but I, I say it's optional. Yeah, other than that, you guys have a great day, night, afternoon, whatever time it is for you, and uh, we'll catch you on the next one.